What's up YouTube, how are you guys doing today? In today's video I'm going to be making a tutorial on what I promised you guys, the new mod menu that I have been working my ass off to get to my channel to come live for you guys. But, this is the Vish mod menu 2.1, I mean 2.0, my bad. And, there is awesome recovery options. You can now clear your bad sport, clear your reports, you can edit your rank, you can also set it for whatever you want. There are so many cool things. I'm not going to be showing you guys exactly what you guys can do with this mod menu. You guys can explore yourself. But let's get into the, today's tutorial. So the first thing you're going to want to do is you guys are going to want to head to the description down below and download my mod. But before I start this video, I want to give a big thanks once again for reaching 300 subscribers. I'm I'm so glad for uh, reaching that. Thank you guys all so, so much for reaching um, 300. I know that might not seem like a lot to you guys, but that's a lot to me. So thank you guys once again. And yeah, and also a lot of people have been tell me that the mod menu the unbanned mod menu isn't working and yes I know um Rockstar just patched it right now uh, about two and a half days ago because I got banned two and a half days ago I was gonna go unban myself but I couldn't so I'm working my ass off to fix that for you guys but anyways let's get into today's tutorial I've been promising you guys that I'll have a new mod menu for you guys to hang out and play with. So what you guys are gonna want to do is head to the description down below and download the mod. And also you're gonna want to get Winmar if you haven't already. So after you got those two uh, files, you're gonna want to open this up with Winmar. And after you open up with Winmar, you're gonna want to you're going to want to drag these files to your desktop just like this. Then you're going to want to make a folder. Since I already did, I'm just going to use the folder right here. And you're going to want to copy all three files right here. After you have all three files right there, all you're going to want to do now is head to Steam. Um, after you head to Steam, you're going to want to right click, go to Properties. And then you're going to want to go to Local Files, Browse Local Files. And then it'll take you to GTA 5 EXE. And all you're going to want to do is right click and paste. After you right click and paste, you're going to want to click replace and you're going to see your mods are there. Um, after that, all you're going to want to do is start the game up and um, I would start single player first and then you could go online. But press F3 to open this. Um, if anybody has any questions, leave it down in the description down below. I'll make sure I help you guys. Thank you guys so much for reaching 300 subscribers. Once again, drop a like if this was helpful. Um, yeah, rate, rate down, down below, uh, 1 out of 10 of how good do you like this mod menu. I tried really hard, um, Rockstar kept patching it, so, this is the final project right now, I will always upgrade it every, every, uh, every two weeks I'll do it, so, hope you guys enjoyed this video, peace.